Oh yeah. Okay. So don't mind the feet. You guys bought your pack out shelves and it comes with this. And so let's just say you don't know what this is. If you're in the trades and you've got a service van, uh, or if you have a trailer or you are a guy that drives a rig, you know what this is. This is E-Track. This is Milwaukee's version that comes with it. And these are E-Track accessories. I got these from DC Cargo Mall. And what I'm doing is working on a couple things using the E-Track that I put up for the Milwaukee stuff. And in the spaces between, I wanted to try some stuff. So I was going to work on something. And uh, I am not one for reinventing the wheel. So this is a tool holder. And I was going to make something like this 3D printed. And I just didn't think it was going to hold up. But this, I don't know if you want to guess what I was going to hang from this. Uh, comment below. Let me know what you think. But uh, I'll tell you in the next video. So that's a kind of tool holder. We've got a shelf bracket. And this is just a generic shelf bracket that I wanted to try a couple ideas out with. And if you look here, you can even get these parts like this. Make some other stuff. But I want to make something like this. I'll give you an example. Like say you want a wood rack. And honestly, you could just put these right up on the E-Track and not go anywhere else. Uh, you could certainly use something like this as well for a wood rack. I don't see why you couldn't. If your track is level, no problem. Here's a pretty big hook, which is definitely going to hold a lot of straps or some bundles of cords or even vacuum hose for dust collection. You got some eyelets, just regular, right, round. Here you've got some like two inch hooks. Okay. And this one is just a little storage tote bin with the E-Track brackets on the back so it'll clip the wall. And this will actually fit in that section that you might have seen in the garage uh, where the fuse panel is. And a lot of those will fit in there. I'm not going to try to block the panel, so I'm not going to use all that. But I'm going to get some more of this E-Track. Uh, this, I believe, you would say is vertical, right? Because it goes up and down and then horizontal goes this way but these face that direction in the horizontal so i need to get some more of that e-track and then i can start putting it on the wall and trying different ideas out so i thought i would show you this quick little product unboxing from dc cargo mall which uh was gracious enough to send these out so i could try some stuff out and roll out what won't work and figure out what will work so that I can put in a bigger order. But uh, these are gonna help figure out what I need. And I will show this off to you guys in an upcoming video. A longer one, of course. Thanks for uh, tuning in. See ya.